Monday afternoon, the Marquette Golden Eagles landed here in New York. Monday night, Buzz Williams gave his team the night off and told them to go relax and have some fun here at ESPN Zone. They played some games, and MUTV gives you the all access pass to see the fun that the guys had here in New York. We had a good practice this morning, and then, you know, we come out here in ESPN Zone, have a little fun. So it's always, you know, to kind of sit back and just enjoy it a little bit. I was telling our guys a while ago when we were upstairs and we were eating, I said, guys, isn't this great? We get to watch everybody else play and sweat and work, and we get to go play some fantasy land games. They're having a good time. It's healthy for them. It, as hard as these guys work, Brad, for them to have 15, 16 hours of just being a normal 20, 22-year-old kid, uh, that's like manna from heaven for these guys. This is definitely a business trip, but uh, you know, every time we're here, we're you know, it's business first. But we always, you know, don't let it get too stressful. So uh, I think that's what we're trying to do here. All right, we got the champion of Hydro Thunder, ladies and gentlemen, Joe Fulce. Uh, Eric, what do you got to say besides second place? No. What you got to say? Second, what, what's no. second place no. smile at? No. Come on. No. Come on. Yeah. Let's hear it, everyone. Reporting live. Jimmy Butler versus Lazar Hayward. Who's winning this game? Me. Me. I'm going to win. I'm going to get the Jeep and beat you, man. All right, you heard it. Jimmy Butler's taking the Jeep and taking down Lazar Hayward. Let's see how this event goes. It's a wreck. Y'all can't keep hitting. It's a wreck. It's a wreck. It's a wreck for you, Jimmy Butler. Y'all can't keep hitting. The game's over. They're crawling out of their cars. Let's find out who won. Who won? And Zar put in a cheat code. He, no, there's no man, cheat yes, code he did. in these games. Who won, though? That's, you still didn't answer the question. No, you put in it. You considered it a win. Who won the game? You put who in won the cheat the game? code. Who won the cheat game? Cheat code. Who won that one over there? I don't think that's the question. I think we're asking who won this big no, game we, here. We won and won right now, so you, that don't count. Oh, so, so now he goes to that. Okay, go to that. we're going to the free throw line to find out who is the true champion between Lazar Hayward oh, we can do that and too. Jimmy Butler. Let's go. Let's go. All right, this one wasn't even remotely close. Look, look at the score. 16 the machine to 38. Broken. 60 to 38. The machine's broke. So there's no you way. excuse for every game. Cheat codes, the machine broke. The machine not broke. Look, welcome to College Hoops. If anyone was going to run to the soccer place, I think it was going to be you. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. I used to play, I used to play a little soccer when I was growing up, so I, I want to see where my skills where, where how, how are my skills right now? All right, we got Mo Acker and Darius Johnson Odom in a very pivotal air hockey matchup. I want to know from you guys, who's going to win this? Uh, it's going to be DJO. Uh, Why do you think? Mo, Mo's got those short little arms. He can't uh, reach that far over the table. Now, earlier in the night, Rob Frozina made a little comment about Maurice Acker. Maurice, can you reiterate to me what Rob said about your air hockey game? He said that I was weak and I had short arms so I couldn't play, but we're about to, we're about to find out real shortly. Real right. shortly. We're going to find out who the true champion is here as Rob takes on Maurice in a little air hockey. I went five hole on the goalie, and the puck got stuck in the machine. Time was running out. It was crunch time, and I hit as much points as I could as possible. We're in New York, Times Square. You know the lights are on. You know we're in the, we're about to be in the Garden, the biggest stage, basketball stage you could possibly be in for college basketball. It's great, man. Hanging with my teammates. It's a great, great experience. Here at the ESPN Zone, there's been one big winner throughout the night. Yeah, um, basically in air hockey. Yeah, I'm undefeated. Most, most challenged me twice, I beat him, took down Joe twice. I may not play a lot on the court, but don't challenge me in air hockey, that's for sure. That's the story here at ESPN's on Rob Frazzini, your big winner in every event. And now he's going into deer hunting. That's it here from ESPN's on Brad Galley reporting for MUTV Sports.